Hello everybody, my name is Matthew Games and welcome back to the Imposter Factory. So, in the last episode we got pushed in this black void, which apparently we couldn't get to at first, but now we can. So, okay, so I can run through here. Okay, so here we go. Huh. <coughs> Is this the stairway to heaven? Because I'm turning into a ghost. <laughs> Sorry, still a little sick. Shut up, act two. Oh boy. <coughs> what the fuck? Well, this has some major to the moon vibes right now. Well, this is supposed to be its apparently sequel. But yeah, because <coughs> as far as I'm aware of, this is not all real. That's the only thing I know from the last episode. Is that none of this is real. Okay, so I have no control over this. It feels odd to just leave everything behind like this. But why did she send me here? What the? Okay, yeah, this is literally like to the moon. I can only go straight. I'm gonna run through this cuz... Oh, hello. Hello? That's what I just said. Stop copying me. Hey. Hey! Wait. She dropped something. <coughs> um. Hey! Oh, this is literally to the moon. What was that? These people? Sorry. Now, now, everyone, stay together, okay? Peter, qu quiet, quit p picking on Lizzie. Or on Izzy. You like that. And Larie. Hey! Larie! No, Larie, or Larie. I have no idea how to pronounce your name. I said, don't go far from the group. Especially you. <coughs> Not three, huh? Is this the past? But how? Okay, this has to be like a prequel or something. Now, Larie, ha I have specific specific instructions from your parents that Hey, stop running. Okay, if you do do that again. Hey, the doctor said your participation on this trip is conditional. Okay, what the hell? The doctor? <coughs> Lurie, if you don't watch it... Lurie? Uh-oh. Lurie? Everything here froze as soon as she fainted. Does that mean this place is about is based on her? This barrier. Hey. Uh Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, yeah, this is literally to the moon. But we're starting from their, her younger years, from her childhood years by the looks of it. Hello. So apparently they had to call an ambulance, which is not good. Um, excuse me while I get myself a cough drop. Sorry, Dad. This it was all my fault, wasn't it? You should have been more careful, Lorene. But no, this isn't all your fault. <laughs> Do you think I still, I'll still be able to go on more class trips? Well, we'll have to see what the doctor says. <laughs> Just be patient, and we'll try our best, okay? Okay. What the hell? This is the second time it happened, isn't it? Yeah. We thought it was a one-off. We really should have allowed shouldn't have allowed shouldn't have allowed her to go without close supervision. Well, fortunately, the fall was cushioned. These early symptoms can be dangerous. Experiment, experimental drugs for them are for them are on the horizon. But in the long run, could you could one of you stay here with Lorene? As for the other, please come with me. Gonna be okay, Lorene. Okay, so I can't talk to her, so I have to. <coughs> Aqua, not so much noise over there. I can't, I can't hear without what they're saying. Is it, is it, is it because she couldn't? So apparently the more I explore, the more data I'm collecting, apparently. Hmm. Nice car. I really, en like, I'm really enjoying this, because look at all these graphics. Like, comparing it to To the Moon, they really stepped up their game. Oh, excuse me. Hey. You need to relax in there. Sorry, Aqua's uh, making some noise in her cage with one of her treats. <clears throat> but when will it happen? Tomorrow? Year? Years down the road? Hey, it's not certain that it it'll turn turn uh. Maligan, right? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. There is a chance that it'll never surface. But there's a chance it will. Then we'll treat it. If we start treatment as soon as it, it worsens. If it worsens, then we'll, we have another chance, right? Still, it's just... It's just feels like there's no there's so much left or left to mere chance three what are you doing here I can't sleep Aww. is there something wrong with me <coughs> don't worry like 
lang. It's nothing we can get through together. I'm gonna start calling her Line now because I can't pronounce her. Her. Or lean. I'm gonna stick with Line. Is what's keeping you up? Is what. Is that keeping you up? No. Oh, then what's the matter? The doctor said I can't go on field trips anymore, didn't he? Not for now, but they are working on something that'll help. Oh! Are you sad that you had to end the trip early today? Yeah. <coughs> I didn't want to leave so soon. Everyone else got to stay the whole day. Let's go back. Go back then. Go back when? Why not now? Really? It's late, Bill. Oh, there's no harm in a little nighttime ex excursion now and then. Besides, I've got just the thing for it. Hooray! Are you coming, Mom? It's okay, I'll stay. I'll make some warm soup for when you two get back. Okay. We can't go in there. <laughs> the Little Prince. Oh, I know this book. They actually uh, made a movie on that movie, uh, on that book. It was a next Netflix, uh, not sponsored by Netflix, but a, a special by them. Wow, is that really a telescope? Sure is. And I'll show you how it works too. I'm gonna put it in the car, okay? Okay, I'm gonna say goodbye to mom. Why is her mom crying? She's suffering with like uh, symptoms of cancer. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Or bless me. <coughs> oh, ugh. oh, dang these allergies. That light again. The re line? Is that you? Okay, so only need one memory, apparently. Sorry, hair. Oh, hello. Fireflies! Just listening to this music, it reminds me of to the moon so much. I'm gonna have to buy the soundtrack to this game as well because, like, I will admit, the developers of this game, whoever writes their music for their games, they do a fantastic job. They really, um, like, bring you into the game itself. With, not only with just, like, the, the unique personalities of the characters that they design, but the fact that they have amazing soundtrack and music that goes with the emotion and the personality of the character, especially with this beautiful, like, environment. It's like, the fact that I can't fathom the I, how much time and effort went into probably just this pixelation design of just the breeze blowing through these flowers making them move. It, stay, it says here that <coughs> it should be just a bit, a bit to the west, but they're 
just so many of them. How can you track track one down? I think I found it. You did? I want to see. Wow, I can't believe it. What are they looking for, the North Star? <laughs> it really does look like a, like, look like the pictures in the book. <laughs> hey, didn't I tell you? You, you name it, and I'll find it. What if they don't have a name? All those stars. They don't all have names yet, do they? Well, why don't you come up, come up here, here, and see for yourself? <laughs> hey, Dad. Do you think there's a star up there with my name? There's already a star with your name. It's just not up here up there yet. What? Oh, that's cheesy, Dad. <coughs> I still like the lavender more, but I'll admit the stars are pretty cool too. So I'm gonna brighten up the light here for a sec. There we go, much better. Although I hope this doesn't uh, mess with the... Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna need to dull that a bit. There we go. You know what's amazing about them line? Even though those stars all shine, so brightly. Main, many of them have already been gone for a long time. Gone? <clears throat> yeah, even the stars don't last forever. But then why do we still see them? Well, that's be because during the time they were here, they shine so bright. They shine so bright. Their light, that their light traveled so far to, it reaches us even now. Wow. I suppose I should thank them then. Without them, I wouldn't be able to see the lavender field. Well then, maybe you should thank me, thank the lavender too. Because without them, there would be a... Nothing to see, right? Right, or yeah. The lavender may be... May not be the sky. But, I like that them better that way. I can play in them, smell them, and see them up close. <coughs> the stars are all so far away, but I guess they got their own part to do too. I wouldn't change a thing about either of them. Wouldn't change a thing, huh? So if you so if you could be either which, what would it be? Would you rather which would you rather be? Hmm? Well, I still like lavender so m more so. So I want to be a star. Why a star if you like lavender more? Duh, Dad. To make sure everyone can see the lavender, of course. I'd shine down on this field so bright and make it as light as light as day as day. Then everybody could always see just how lovely it is. <laughs> Sounds like you'd make a wonderful star line. Aww. Well, that's so 
that's so adorable. This is a, this is nice, Dad. I wish I could stay up late and come here every week. <coughs> but Dad, could I ask you something? Yes, Lon. Why was Mom crying? So she went from a kid to a tea. Okay, so a birthday party. <laughs> Doctor's appointment. <laughs> Sorry, it's just mm, still sick. So adult calls a teenager still. God, up. Hello. That was weird. <coughs> What the? So now we're in a classroom. <coughs> Just like the giraffes. Uh, the, the prepared month is also well, used, used as an example of natural selection. Although, the experiment has been debated. The hypothesis remains unchanged. That when a generic mutation occurs, natural selection decides whether it lives or it di dies out. If the mutation is good, then the organism is more likely to survive and pass on its, on its genes. <coughs> and if the mutation is harmful, it lessens likely to it's less likely to survive and reduce thus further furthering its thus uh, filtering itself out. seemed upset. And then there's the whole leaving in the middle of class thing. I just didn't want to waste time, that's all. I was already familiar, familiar with the topic being being taught. So you skipped to skip class to read? What even is that? Microbiology. <coughs> oh, come on. You skip Stacy's part. You skip Stacy's parties, but you have time to frickin' micro blah blah. High school years are for making memories. Huh? You got an interesting point. Sorry, I don't have any Kleenex close by at the moment. Hey. Where are you going? I'm going to find some books on the foundation of memories. That's not what I meant. I know, but thanks anyway. <coughs> Wait, is this? No. No, it can't be. Is 
this the creator of this company Sigma? Sigma? <laughs> okay, so I need to find memories here. The only thing I can think of, this has to be about the person who created the machine. Still a bit behind schedule, isn't it? Yeah, but I'll catch up. Excuse me, I need to swing my drink. Much better. Anyways. <laughs> There's still a lot to analyze, but at least I have data now. Hmm, good. I know it's a lot, but yours is one I'm is the one I'm looking forward to the most. <coughs> no pressure. Uh, when you say no pressure, that is putting pressure on somebody. You do realize that, right? Wait, that's a cat scan. What's that doing in here? Hello. I've never had a cat scan before, but I know what the machine looks like because. Uh, I've had family members that have had to get CAT scans. <coughs> <coughs> or, not CAT scan, or, or is it? Or is that a CAT scan? Or I know it's like a radiation scan thing that does like an x-ray of your body. Okay, so we can't go that way. Uh oh. That's it. I'm dropping out. Eh? <clears throat> I guess this place is no joke. But come to think of it, why would, why do I feel as if, as if I graduated from somewhere just like this? <laughs> well, that, that's because you're right there, you idiot. <coughs> what the pug? Excuse me. Is this seat free? Seems like it. <laughs> Wait, if this is supposed to be the past, and my past too, how come I don't remember this at all? Oh no, don't tell me you took the experimental drugs too. I mean, this place is familiar and all, but... Hey, why is it getting darker? Wait, are these two the main developers of the machine? Oh no. Huh, what? Is it really midnight already? Oh man, guess so. You dozed off too, huh? Yeah, I can't believe this. This is the second time this week. It's gonna be a mess. It's going to mess up my schedule. You look a little... burnt out. Yeah, well, who isn't nowadays? Actually... How did you fall asleep like that? Uh, well... Jet lag. Jet lag? Yeah, I just came back from uh, backpacking around the world. Wow, lucky. Yeah. 
but now I gotta, now I gotta chat, chat up. Wait, you mean, you literally just took a trip in the middle of the semester. Yep. Why? <clears throat> Alright, maybe I should go back to work while I am, while I'm still sane. And, not now, messenger. <coughs> Me too, I got a bunch of essays to catch up on. Rough, what's your major? I'm majoring in li li liberal arts. Oh, liberal arts can be very useful. I didn't even say anything that was unprovoked. Look, I'm being serious. I don't know why you guys get so much flock around here. <laughs> what are you majoring in? Me, I'm in it. In the. Well, it's a little embarrassing. It's okay, go on, what is it? Neuroscience. Doctorate and technology. <laughs> You're trying to go for three, jeez. You bastard. <clears throat> why? So why are you? So what are you working on becoming a doctor? Well, no, I'm more into the research, the research side. My paper is on a, on the. Uh, synaptic modification and encoding of memory. What's wrong? It's nothing. Well, it's gonna be a long night. I'll I'm gonna grab some coffee from across the hall. You want one too? Sure, thanks. <clears throat> My name is Quincy, by the way. I'm lying. We knew each other, but I don't recall any of it. walking in a straight line again. <coughs> Hopefully I'm not missing anything, actually. I'm gonna go back real quick. I hope I didn't miss anything in this uh, area because... Okay, I can't go any further that way. How about this way? Okay, can't go that way. So yeah, it's literally just one of those walking straight ports. So, this must be the whole time time going by thing. <coughs> Not now. Okay, so she's looking at, at, at Quincy. are starting again to sing. <clears throat> Anyways. Huh. This has to be what I... What... Alright, let's see here. <clears throat> so another memory reel. So, there I'm talking more than hanging out, I'm guessing. 
Do they end up, like, sharing their research or something together, and he ends up being... Okay, so we... D Almost looks like they're distancing themselves from each other a little bit, but there he is. There we go, passing by each other. <coughs> oh, she... Oh, that's cute. He has... He's starting to get a crush on her. They meet each other. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, so these have to be the two people that created the machine for a Sigma mind. Okay, so they're enjoying a meal together by the looks of it. What's going on here? This is getting creepy. And why am I moving so slow? I can't even sprint. Okay, their computers are there. And how about the Eiffel Tower? Yeah, it's quite a sight. <coughs> I mean, there are a lot of taller structures nowadays, but there's just something about the way it stands along the horizon. It sounds nice. Seems seeing all of those pre places up close. I wonder if diff if it's different from the pictures. Are you kidding? Of course it's different. It's standing beneath the proof of civilization. Close enough to reach out and touch history. I hope your anthropology professor shares the same level of enthusiasm. <coughs> Eiffel Tower, the Pyramids of Giza, the Great Wall. Honestly, I've always wanted to go to then why don't you? I mean, if I'm able to save up for a trip, I'm sure you could too. No, it's just... I don't have the time. Don't have the time? I know you're busy, but surely you can spare a few weeks. It's not just that. I choose my, my path... I chose my path a long time ago, Quincy. I have to find a place where I'll leave a mark, but I don't know how long I have to get there. <coughs> Sorry. It's nice chat chatting gl glimpses of the scenery as I go about. If I were to stop and smell the roses, I'm afraid I'd realize how nice it all it all is and just stay. I see. That's quite a dramatic way of putting it. But it's also kind of romantic. Reminds me of those st stars in the sky. Huh? Like they shine and bright, they shine and brighten the earth below, but can't be a part part of this world themselves. Y yes. Something like that. Oh, she struck a chord. Or he struck a chord with her. <coughs> Our time here is so limited. I always feel such feel such a, a pressure to make something of it. Huh? Well, I guess that always always had to make a make a difference effect on me when I think of how limited our time here is I can't help but want to simply enjoy it while it lasts I guess it's kind of selfish in in comparison <coughs> there's nothing wrong with simply wanting to experience the world Sounds like something my grandpa would say. 
Um, I mean that in I mean that in the nicest way, of course. It's just her grand my grandma would say. She's it's just she always lived life one day at a time in the present sense. Were you and your grandma close? <clears throat> sure. My parents pre passed away in an accident when I was young, so she brought so she brought me up. I'm sorry to hear. Well, it was a long time ago. But I remember when it when it first happened, people thought grandma was heartless because well, because she seemed to move on with her new life and routine rather fast. But I knew it was because of that. She still grieved and rem reminisced about them every day, missing them. But she just had this view of on, on life. <coughs> she was just grateful to be here to take the the bliss bliss uh, blissful with the tragic to be reborn each day she always joked that even if the world ended tomorrow she'd still be okay with it even if the world ended tomorrow I envy her. I'm not sure if I'd be able to live a day, live day to day like that. Me neither, but I guess it did rub off on me in a bit though, th uh, through the years. She passed away not long before we first met actually. Developed Alzheimer's later in life and, and collapsed and complications got her when we first met is that why you went on that trip you know when you told me about your paper when I came back I really questioned the path I chose I thought there's something someone whose work could make a difference and here I am just prancing through life for myself. <clears throat> it's not exactly an um, altruistic choice on my part either, but either to be honest. <clears throat> it's more like an impulse. In a way, I wish I could feel con connect content just being carefree and have fun, but I can't. Sometimes I wonder if I'd be bet bitter about it in the end. <laughs> well, sounds like maybe we could keep each other in check. Maybe we could. Hey, what do you think if, if, I mean, you know, we wanted, we, I, uh, sorry, I am very tired. If, I mean, I know we hang out and now and then already, but what if, what if, what if we, we do that but more? Like, I know this place outside of campus that makes the best avocado salad. <clears throat> Are you asking me out? Well, if you put it that way, yeah, I guess I am. I don't think that's a good idea. Not now. It's cause I'm a bit, I'm a liberal artist major, isn't it? I know, I'm just kidding. 
but it's okay. I get it. No hard feelings. Let's just... I'm sick, Quincy. I have been since I was a kid. Every morning I wake up, I'm never sure if it'll take a turn for the worse. I'm a time bomb. Oh. Wait. What? Then how? I'm very concerned here. I guess I can't be. I guess. I guess I can be quite an heiress. Wait, but if I can't remember any of this, is it really me? Is it still really me? What'd you put in, put in the bag? Excuse me, is this seat seat free? It's taken, sorry. Oh, you, you actually did develop feelings for Quincy. Quincy, where are you? This girl is sad. Wait, did, maybe he changed. Maybe wait a minute. Oh, it's her phone. You sent her a message. <coughs> That's all I've got. But the barrier is still standing. I can't go back. Wait, unless I'm supposed to just... Wait. Why does it feel like... <coughs> what the? But why didn't that work on the other ones? Hmm. Excuse me, put another, need another cough drop. Okay, so. This is her as an adult. Quincy! You made it! <coughs> that jacket. Yeah! I got your message. Wow, that's a lovely dress. Thanks. It's a bit chilly, though. I thought we were going somewhere indoors. Oh, wait a minute. When I said to dress well, I meant warmly. Because of this freaky cold weather in for, uh, 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 weather front tonight. And you know, snow and autumn. Oh, I get it. You wanted me to put this move on you, huh? What? No, that's not what I... Test pass, score one for Quincy. <laughs> Come on, follow me. Hey! Really? It was an honest mistake. <coughs> Hold on. I 
just gotta make sure everything's still okay up here. Okay, good. Good to go. But maybe you could blindfold yourself for the surprise. I don't think that's a good, good idea, walking upstairs. Good point. Okay then, just walk up real slowly. you make that your that for me of course I mean you want to see the world right oh this is so sweet but I don't like the fact this is that this is a highway Aren't you worried about cars? Huh? No offense to the real thing, but this is actually kind of clever. It is, right? Wait, what do you mean by no offense to the real thing? Next stop, Stonehenge. Oh, neat. Does the... Cafeteria know that... They are missing trays, though. I'll return them in the morning. The Sydney Opera House. You'd love. I'd love to see the opera one day. Why wait? When you can't do it right now, right now. On second thought. <coughs> Wait, what did I miss over here? Oh wait, there's a lot of things. I mean, no Michelangelo, but duct tape, really? Hey, I'm not, I'm, hey, I'm on a budget here. I can't tell, do you have a beard? No, you don't. Okay, why is that one missing still? Some missing still. It's not Big Ben, but it's but it's a Ben. Huh? It's a pizza clock. Always. Okay, so there is more stuff. Behold the the the, de the decent wall. Wow. Please tell me you didn't eat all the that take up by yourself. I wish I could, I really do. <coughs> the Leaning Tower of Pisa of Coffee. Missed opportunity with the Pizza Ben in Tower earlier, perhaps. not believe the number of balls I had to find to for this Taj, Ma Taj Mahal. I count seven. Oh uh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Hmm. Isn't one of the pyramids missing? Yeah, someone 
someone's using the using it as a trap and someone's using these as pyramids the one with the bigger bigger vision I say oh that was sweet This was actually really nice. Thank you for putting it all together for me. Must have taken a while, huh? Well, I don't like to brag, but you wouldn't believe how much I had to eat to get all the props. Line, look. I know you don't have time to be distracted from your goals, but I'm not here to do that. <clears throat> I know you can't walk walk your path alone, but uh, alone, and it must be hard sometimes. But perhaps it doesn't have to be like that. If you want to see the world, I'll bring it to you. When you need a reason to keep going, I'll remind you. And if you want the sky, want the sky, then maybe, maybe I can be the earth. You're proud of that line, huh? Come on. <clears throat> it is lonely. I'll give you that. Walking this road sometimes, I think. If I have not, I have to not look in order to keep going, then how far can I really go? And it's not that I don't want to believe, want to, want to believe me. Finding someone settling down and maybe maybe starting a family it's not the first time i've thought about it but all things but all this this isn't why i said i wouldn't be a good it would be a good idea <coughs> it still i it still doesn't stop you from putting on the dress tonight hey it's me you're worried about. You don't have to. I'll be okay. My choice is my own. All you have to, to, de to decide for is yourself. After all, my grandma raised me to be the way I, the way I am, remember? <laughs> if the world ends tomorrow. But until then, see how long I'm recording. Okay, so this is a good place to stop the recording for now, so I'm just going to quickly save real quick. I'll save right there. Anyways, so, this has been the Imposter Factory, and uh, so yeah, this has been uh, this episode of the Imposter Factory, so I hope everyone's enjoying this game, because I am thoroughly enjoying this, and there is still that part of me that feels like that these two, or at least the woman, is the creator of the device that, uh, that, uh, that the two scientists from To the Moon used. But, anyways, there are, we'll find out when we further progress in the game, but anyways. 
Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and share this video with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. And like always, I'll see you, my fellow gamers, in the next video.